There's more love to celebrate on Valentine's Day, and why not try that with a musical walk down memory lane? This month, Basil Valdez ties up with divas from the 70s and no less than Miss Celeste Legaspi for a reunion concert that you don't want to miss. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Now, gracing the morning stage, Miss Celeste Legaspi. Thank you, thank you. That Maraming voice, oh, that voice, so clear and so, so much, so more soul nowadays. Uh, yeah. As you get older, you get more soul. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, we want to talk a little bit about that, uh, Celeste. Well, I mean, you guys are gearing up for this fantastic uh, Valentine's concert. Yes. Give us a little bit yes. of uh, the broad strokes um, on that. Uh, we have the uh, pre-Valentine concert. Mm -hmm. It's February 13. Okay. And uh, there's 11 of us mm -hmm. actually. Uh, Basil, Haji, Rayan, Jackie, Tilly, Louis, uh, you name it. Uh, I mean it's a reunion of the circus band, the new minstrels, and the ambivalent crowd, which is me. Which is you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, and well, the director, Leo Real. Oh, well, there you go. I mean, yeah. everybody, I'm sure, is looking forward to this. I mean, people who I were so. uh, people who were uh, uh, around during the 70s and, and, and really sort of uh, followed the, the careers of, uh, these, of uh, all these big bands. You know, I am very, about. very happy to be in this concert mm -hmm. because I am with 
excellent Filipino singers. Absolutely. Such beautiful Filipino voices. Absolutely, with me, really. absolutely. What sort of music are we looking forward to here? In, in oh, a lot of 70s mm -hmm, stuff. Mm -hmm. Donna Summers is always there. All right. <laughs> and then we're all singing our own hits, mm -hmm. like Basil singing Ayun at Kailanman, etc., etc. So it's a, it's a series of hit after hit, hit after, after hit. hit yeah, after hit after yeah, hit. Okay, yeah. a bit of a hit overload. Really. Uh, <laughs> no, not really, because we're really cute. <laughs> right, right. I, I won't argue with that. <laughs> okay, well, well, you know, speaking of, of where we are now, you know, we're, we're sort of, uh, I mean, particularly for the pre Valentine's concert, it's mm -hmm. sort of a, a revival, but I want to sort of jump back to, to, to the very beginning, you know, okay. I mean, uh, well, the, the music never really goes away. I mean, this this uh, this brand of uh, music that you guys are, are known for, um, whereas you know, music nowadays, hits nowadays, apples and oranges, obviously. But I mean, there's something very special about music that was written uh, in that in era. the 70s yeah. and into the 80s. Yeah. Well, I think that was because that was the first time really that uh, there was an emphasis on original Filipino music, mm -hmm. and so there were a lot of composers who came out and gave us this beautiful music and words, right? Also, and then and then it, it came together because. We were there, we were the singers then, mm -hmm. and uh, we were all trained in bands mm -hmm. and in groups, mm -hmm. and that was good too. Right. And I think that, that all spelled into a, a great, wonderful moment in the 70s. And I'm very, very, very lucky and very grateful that I was part of it. Well, we're very lucky and grateful that you continue oh, to wow, make that Oh, wow, thank music. you. Thank <laughs> you so much. Thank okay, you. well, I mean, from, from the heyday in the 70s to the 80s, you know, at some point you sort of decided uh, you know what? I'm gonna take a break from from the entertainment business. Yeah. And I'm gonna <laughs> do something different. What what exactly prompted you to sort of decide to you know uh, come back? Well, no, to, to take a rest, so to oh, speak. Oh, to take a rest. Yeah, absolutely. I well, I got tired. Mm -hmm. That's really what happened to me. I got tired. Mm -hmm. I had some um, health issues, mm -hmm. and then I I wanted to do something else right. really, and then I realized I missed the music. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, I did some acting, I did right. theater. Uh, I, I want to sort of uh, touch on that. Uh, yeah. the, the, you know, are those are those very separate hats for you, uh, you know, performing mm, on no, stage, actually, singing no, and no. acting? It's, it's actually all the same. Yeah? It's actually all the same. And I was very fortunate that I got training in Actor Studio East, mm -hmm. which is, uh, you know, every actor should do that. And then I really went seriously into acting right. in, in, uh, no, in theater and in TV. So right. That is, and then I'm I'm also able to use that in my performances. Right. I wanted to, uh, to sort of segue into that. I mean, from 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 that uh, decision you made to sort of take a break, then then you got into exploring uh, other, other venues of your creativity yes, and, and, yes, and artistry, yes. uh, and then now you you you're you're back now, uh, sort of with a renewed vigor, so to speak, <laughs> uh, for the music. Uh, you know, what what led you there? Well, I've always missed the music. Mm -hmm. I would wake up in the morning and 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 I would. You know when that moment in the morning when you're kind of awake but you're not yet awake, right? And then you're, and I miss the music. I'm missing a melody. Mm -hmm. I'm, I, I knew. I always knew that I missed the music, and I always knew that I missed the performing. Mm -hmm. And and so here I am, and I hope that the audience is still out there wanting to hear. Absolutely, someone. they they are. Um, what is it about the the performing that uh, you missed? Uh, what is that? Uh, it's the connection between the performer and the audience. Mm -hmm. That's that's the most important thing in a performance. Okay, actually. how 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 do you describe that? I mean, it's what's that, what's that it's something that happens. Sometimes it doesn't happen. Mm -hmm. It's a very very special moment when you are together. And I sound so OA, but no, that's really no, the truth. Uh, it happens because um, the audience is so with you, mm -hmm. and and you you become comfortable and relaxed, mm -hmm. and it and that's one moment that all performers uh, get addicted to. Right. I guess. Right. Okay. <laughs> Well, that addiction has come back. I mean, you're, you're, like you said, you're, you're <laughs> yes, back. Yes, I'm uh, an addict. <laughs> <laughs> you're back on stage, and we're we're certainly happy to to, to see that. Uh, where's Where's your music now? What is it uh, after so many years uh, of doing the, the beautiful music that you do? Uh, what else is it that you that you want to to, to bring or to discover to well, experience um, and to? Well, uh, I know that my husband has written several melodies right. and lyrics mm -hmm. that hasn't been recorded yet. Mm -hmm. And I'm kind of thinking of, uh, but I also want to do something with my son and my daughter. Right. Who okay. My son is in a band, my daughter yes, sings. Yes, uh, we've, we've had them all yes, over generations. Yes, I know. Excellent. And, and uh, they all do original works. Mm -hmm. and, and I'd like to do that with them. It's, it's really neat. And then uh, I want to do uh, more old songs right. too because they're really precious. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, one of the things I'd like to do 
is to challenge Basil Valdez to a duet okay. of an ending Willie Cruz song. Okay, well, know? let's make it official now. <laughs> yes, the, the gauntlet yeah. has been laid down. <laughs> yeah, I, I've slapped him with that gauntlet many times. And, you know, <laughs> I'm waiting for him to pick it up. <laughs> All right, okay. Well, you, you are a staunch advocate of, of original Filipino music. Yes, of you know, course. Uh, oh. you, this is and the uh, really OPM, the organization, too. Right, yes. okay. I mean, obviously, we have something special. Uh, I wanted to ask your opinion. We have something special as Filipino songwriters, performers, singers, you know, can, can you put your finger on that? What is that quality that, that sort of really makes us different and stand out? <laughs> I, I think, I think, um, I don't actually, soul, yeah. but that's so vague. Mm -hmm. I think, uh, I think it's the way we look at life. Nothing brings us down. Mm -hmm. And uh, everything is smiled at. Right. Uh, but deep down inside us, we know that life is hard. Mm -hmm. Life is harsh. But we have our family. We have our country, which is really very beautiful. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have our, you know, anybody can sing. Everybody can I, I sing. I think I'm proof that, that there are exceptions to the rule. On that uh, you can sing. I don't oh, believe you. Oh, boy. Oh, no. I think everybody <laughs> in the studio here can sing. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Anybody in the Philippines can sing. Mm -hmm. And you just have to ask a foreigner about that. Right. Okay. And uh, I think it's that combination of, of, of needing to adjust to life, mm -hmm. but at the same time, being able to to smile about it. I think that is the unique thing that gives us our soul. Right. That the other, maybe the other performers in other countries who have it so good, mm -hmm. just mm -hmm. unfortunately for them, they don't have to suffer that. So, right. you know, so their performances are I know, <laughs> one thing. <laughs> I'm so uh, philosophizing well, there you go. Here. Okay, well, there you go. Well, whatever that quality is, uh, we can't get enough of it, and we're looking forward to hearing more of it. We've got the details uh, up on screen. Let's flash those details up on screen. There it is. It's uh, Viva Live Presents. Uh, Reunited in Love, okay. the greatest hit concert right. at February on February 13 at the PICC Plenary Hall. Uh, with Haji and Pat, Jackie, Pili Boreno, Basil Valdez, the Circus Band, and Chad Borja, Rayan Fuentes, Ding Mercado, Louis Reyes, Eugene Villaluz of the New Minstrels, and myself of the Ambivalent <laughs> There you go. For, uh, tickets? for tickets, call SM Tickets, Ticket World, Ticket Net, and Viva Live. There you go. Well, thank you so much. It's always such a pleasure to hear you sing. And thank I you. think people are looking thank forward you. to that again on February 13th. Thank you so much. Marami salamat. Marami salamat. Thank you. Folks, Tony Gonzaga shows off her 2 million peso engagement ring. And the Elasto Painters of the PBA.